Welcome back to the Cardboard Gamble. Um, on break from watching the Eagles play the Seahawks, which is really boring, <laughs> I thought it would be a better game. I don't know. Actually, I thought it would be um, more one-sided than it actually is. So, But anyways, while they're talking out in the locker room, I have a couple videos I've been waiting to make. Um, I'm going to split it up because there's a lot to go over, but I'm going to split it up to a couple videos. But the first one is, um, I have this really kind of cool story. So one night I was staying up way too late, just looking over Facebook and everything. I don't know. I'm, I'm definitely a night owl. And I happened to see one of the break groups that I follow. They were just doing a random free break. So I was like, okay, random free break, what's the catch? I don't know. I was the first person to read it, so I basically had my choice of teams. My first instinct was, go for the Lions. So, I mean, I could have picked the Chiefs, I could have picked the Bengals, I could have picked Dolphins, whoever, and I picked the Lions. But that was ended up being a good move. It was one box of, um, yeah, what is it called? <laughs> I think it's just called Panini Black. No, wait. Why can I not think of this? Oh, this is going to be... I'm going to be such a dork when this comes out. But anyways. um, Yeah, I think it's just called Black. Black football? I'm, I'm not sure. Anyways, there's only five cards in the in the box. um, And so I had basically... So those there five... At one in a five chance that I was going to get a lion. Um, and... Turns out, one of them was a lion, which was lucky. And, I mean, so I got this card completely free. Let me give a shout-out to um, Wolfie's Box Breaks. Uh, and I believe they sell as thumbs-up cards on um, eBay. I'll put a link for sure. Uh, so, yeah. Wolfie's Box Breaks, Thumbs Up Cards. They did this really cool free break. And I ended up... Oh, yeah. He included... Um, he included a, a car, a business card. I asked him to. Uh, because I told him I was going to show this on my channel. So, yeah. Thumbsupcards.com. And that's also who they sell under. And... Um, they, they, they ship impeccably. But I ended up getting this Quintez Cephas Auto um, out of one ninety nine, one sixty six out of one ninety nine. Yeah, it's just called black. Um, so I he shrink wraps everything, and I always feel like I don't want to take it out. But since he included the, his card this time, I might have to break this free. Um, so hang on a second. Alright, so I let him loose here. Here's the card, and here's the back of the card. Um, which, I, I don't know, this is just, it was, I just felt like it was super lucky. Uh, yeah, just Panini Black Football. Um, yeah, and I got the numbered auto. I think there's like two autos in the box, and I got one of them. So, that was super cool. Like a free card. Super free. And it's kind of thick, but anyways, um... Thumbs up cards, he does a really good job packaging things. He mails everything in a box with lots of padding. And so I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to put this up. And then next to it, I'm going to display this for the duration of the video. Got all my stands here. I'll save a couple because I'm hoping this next box might have a couple I want to display too. Uh, this one is from Bengals Collector. He and I struck up a deal because I was lucky enough to find the um, Donruss Holiday Sweater card boxes, uh, blasters. And he struck up a deal that if I sent him one, he would send me a Lions Care Package. So this is pretty heavy. Um, and I'm going to open it up probably the best way I can without... Um, 
setting free any of our personal information. Um, and I'm really excited to see uh, what he included in here. He is not a Lions collector, although he does collect Barry Sanders, I believe. So I can't see, you know, him wanting to hold on to any any cards or holding back. So let me just, I'm going to do this kind of secretly behind the camera. I'm not taking anything out or adding anything. I'm just trying to keep the sensitive information sensitive. All right. So what I see is a ton. And this is packed impeccably well. So I'm going to just pull them out a little at a time. And pile by pile, I'll go through them. Um, this is super neat. Got some of the packing peanuts, undoubtedly from the uh, um, boom boxes. <laughs> I know he's big on boom boxes, like myself. So let's see what we have immediately. I think I'm gonna save this one for last because that looks like a cool, cool one on the back there. Actually, they all look really cool. All right, let's see. Here we go. Oh, well, I should have <laughs> I should have read this first. Here is the start of your Bengals collection. <laughs> Bengals collector. And there's a Boomer Ison Ison. Yeah, Ison. That's how you say it. I've heard Boomer Ison before. So, and painter's tape cuz he knows what he's doing. So, here's card number 1, Boomer Ison. <laughs> Bengals collection. This is from 19... Wow, really? 1986 tops. And I don't think this is a reprint or anything. So that's really cool. I'll, I'll just put that up there. Okay. It looks like there is a ton to get through. So this is super cool. Already I am like, this is definitely worth the cost of a blaster. So we have a Kenny Galladay that is a green parallel from Prestige 2020. We have a Matthew Stafford from Elite 2020. I think that's the 2020 design. Nope, 2019. It's very similar. The 2019 and the 2020 are very similar. So 2019. Um, we have Classics 2016 of Calvin Johnson. And also, Kelvin Johnson Gridiron Gear, 2011. I want to put all these up on standards. <laughs> um, and then also, from that same product, Matthew Stafford, 2000. I'm, look I'm looking out off of the camera and also, like, trying not to stiff you guys with a view, but I'm, I'm excited to look. So I'm not looking through the camera like I usually do. Um, Matthew Stafford, same product over here. Calvin Johnson, this is tops. I have some tops, but not Calvin Johnson tops. Um, 2014. Chris Spielman, wow, this is like really beefing up my collection of lions, especially. Oh, this is like, um, like a, it's a different size card. It's like a little mini postcard. 1988 Lions card, 13 of 14, courtesy of the Detroit Lions, WJR. Wow, this is cool. I can definitely say 100% I do not have this. James Jones fullback. This is something really cool. Let's put that up. I do not have that yet. <laughs> All right, I like this one too. Wow, this is like a nice embossed, the All Madden team. Benny Blades. Wow, cool card. Number 22. Wow, I'm going to definitely, like, after I'm done filming, I'm going to look at all these, like, super closely. Uh, Jason Hansen. Don't have a Jason Hansen card. So this is from 93 Tops. Barry Sanders. He gave up some of his Barry Sanders. Uh, score. This is definitely... 1990, yeah. Rodney Pete. 93. And uh, I will say if I if I say any of the older names wrong, it's because I, I um. I don't know. I guess I started maybe like late 90s, early 2000s, really paying attention. So, um. 
Yeah, this is cool. It's like a team card. Spirit of the game. Pro set. I definitely don't have that. And I don't have this. This is, is like a score, I think. Nope, it's, it's, it's either a different year or some sort of photo variation. Yeah, they're both. Oh, it's, so it's like an insert. Ground force. All right. So this is a score insert called Ground Force. These are both from 1990. All right. So I'm amassing quite the collection at the moment down here. But there's still like a few packs to go through, a few team bags to go through. So this looks like we're going way back in time here. Uh, Charlie Sanders, tight end. Oh. No, nope. is this just because of the, okay, yeah, this is just like a Hall of Fame thing, <laughs> it kind of threw me because this looks like a newer card, but definitely, Charlie Sanders is definitely not from 2007, so that's cool, oh, I love what's coming up after this, so we have, um, this is a Topps team one, and behind that is, Carry on Johnson Instant Impact Prism from 2018. Super cool card. I gotta put that one up there. Super cool card. Theoretic Prominence. This is a thick card. Could this be numbered possibly? No, it's just a really thick card. So in 2013. Prominence must have been just a higher end brand. Ooh, we got a die cut Matthew Stafford Strata. I like this die cut. Wow, look at that. This is from 2014. That's a cool card. Very cool. Um, got a Jerry Ball from Fleer 92. Chris Spielman from Pro Set 92. Um, Pro Set is this? Michael Coffer. All right, so that was from 91. All right, Mel Gray, League Leaders, Fleer 92. Herman Moore, yeah, that's who I thought that was for some reason, but I didn't want to sound stupid and say it out loud, so. Herman Moore, oh, got a cool Detroit Lions like, shield sticker from 1990. Wow, that's like the original Panini logo. Very cool. This is actually really neat. Right here. I might even put that. I'm going to throw that in the top order because I think that's really cool. I don't know if I can get it to... Yeah. There we go. Kind of keep sliding it in there. That is super cool. I mean, probably if you weren't a Lions fan, you would say, okay, whatever. That's like, you know, nothing spectacular. But since I am a Lions fan, sorry, I'm covering up. Thumbs up for the moment, because that's really neat. Okay, we got um, play a ninety one for the playoffs from ninety one. Eric Kramer from ninety two. Robert Porsche Porsche from ninety two. Tracy Hayworth. Andre Ware, and this one's from Tops 92 and Fleer 90. This is definitely, I do not have, and you know who's really going to like this? Della's really going to like these. Because this is like when he was big into, I mean, he's big into football now, but like this was when he was really like super, super, super into it. He likes, and also his dad, my father-in-law, they're going to love to look through these. For sure. So I do greatly appreciate this. All right. Matthew Stafford from recent score, 2019. TJ Hawkinson, rookie card. 
That's cool. I'm actually going to throw that one in the top loader. Because he's a good, he's a beast. He's a good tight end. I think he's probably going to, he's probably going to be a big name. <laughs> All right. Rookies and Stars standing ovation from 2018. Kelvin Johnson, 2019 Donruss. Darius Slay from 19 uh, score. Uh, Ezekiel Ansah from the same year. Luke Wilson, same year. Theoretic. All right, so this is like the whole set from score 2019. Um, I think... I don't really have very many of these, so this is cool. I'm trying to get rid of that glare a little bit. Kenny Galladay. Yeah, I think that was pretty much the entire entire uh, group from that year. Trey Flowers from Donruss 2020. Jeff Okuda, rookie. He's uh, turning out to be a pretty good defender. Makes a couple of good plays every... I mean, it's hard to say with the Lions because, you know, I'm not going to slam my own team, but <laughs> you know. <laughs> uh, Matt Stafford from score of 2013. Got uh, another Jeff Okuda rookie. Got uh, Matthew Stafford from 2020 Donruss. Kerryon Johnson from Donruss. This has to be a throwback, like, yeah. Because <laughs> Carry On Johnson, I think, was probably, like, an infant in 2000. So this is from 2020. Cool, this is a 2020 Donruss, like, a throwback. Nice. I like this one. I'll put this one on top loader, too. I'm probably going to put some more of these in top loaders. <laughs> but just for, because I want to... Uh, another Kenny Galladay, this time Absolute 2020. Matthew Stafford, Unparalleled. I love the shiny, shiny Unparalleled. Um, and, ooh, look at this one. Kelvin Johnson intros Die Cut Prism from 2015. This is a nice, I gotta get some more stands up here. This is a nice one, too. Let me just kind of slide those back, and we'll put this one up here, too. Nice. This is, like, shaping up to be... All right, so here we go. This is the grand finale. Like, the whole thing wasn't awesome. <laughs> All right, we got TJ Hawkinson. This is 19 absolute, his rookie year. Uh, Matthew Stafford playbook from 2018. TJ Hawkinson. Oh, look at this. Is this like a sticker or a tattoo? Temporary tattoo. Wow. From uh, 2008. <laughs> Very cool. Very cool. I'm going to hide that one from Jack because he'll want to put it on. We got Barry Sanders, the red press proof of Carry On Johnson. And looks like a crown royal. Ooh, DeAndre Swift, and I do not have the blue. I do not have the blue, so this is really cool. I do appreciate this one as well. I bought the red one online because I'm too cheap. I can't afford to, uh, <laughs> a crown royal box. So, I bought the red one online, but I don't have the blue, so I appreciate that, just if I didn't show you the back. I appreciate that one. And then another, um, DeAndre Swift. So, I wonder if this is, is this from, um, Chronicles then? Let me see. Yes, this one's from Chronicles. And so, this must be Chronicles. Yep, I think these, this one is probably from Chronicles too. So all, basically almost all of the DeAndre Swift Chronicles um, rookies, which I absolutely love. So I'm going to put those in sleeves, but I'll kind of keep those separate. And then a DeAndre Swift leaf. 
rookie. I don't have this one either. 2020. Is this from... No, I just... I'm, I don't know. I've never seen that before in my life. Huh. But I like it. And I know you guys saw it. The last one. We got a Michael Les Leshauer running he's a running back this is from 2011 it's an auto that is out of 10 so yeah this is a cool card i don't have many lions autos other than swift so and now i have one that is out of 10 so bengal's collector you have outdone yourself this is most certainly, most certainly worth a $20 blaster. So I am glad I made that deal. And, I mean, I feel like this this is probably, you've been probably holding on to some of these cards for a while. So I do appreciate them. And you definitely pass them on to somebody who is going to take care of them and appreciate them as well. So, um, that is it. Uh, we're over 20 minutes now, so I... We'll see you next time, and thanks for watching me go through this whole giant Lions collection. Uh, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.